Sean, you guys were up as many as 14 in the third. It was tied heading into the fourth. What did it take to put these guys away? They just stops. You got to get stops and you got to make shots. And, you know, they made a run in the third quarter. They got some talent. They got a lot of young talent. Wiggins got it going. Towns uh, played exceptionally well. Rubio kept the pace up. So, you know, in the fourth quarter, that's our calmest quarter for us. As a veteran ball club, that's, some, that's when we get more calm. And uh, we did that. We showed that. Watching you throughout the game, though, I felt like you could have or you thought your team could have been advancing the lead, but the Timberwolves continue to hang around. What what about those moments were mental, what were physical? Well, I mean, listen, we uh we shortchanged right now, you know, and uh, but that's not an excuse. Guys came into play. D. Will gave us a heck of a spark again. Channing shot the ball exceptionally well. Double T, Kyrie, everybody. You know, so, you know, we know it's a young team and they're, I mean, all, most of those guys are going to play high 30s and even in their 40s, so we just got to try to keep the pace, get some time and stops, which we did. You mentioned with D. Will, he hasn't had a whole lot of practice time, but yet he's been able to impact in different ways. What about his force, though, and his ability to make winning plays stands out to you? Just try to put him in position to be successful until we can get some practice time and we can start implementing our sets, but he's a freakish athlete. You know, he's a great defensive player. Uh, he rebounds exceptionally well, and he runs. That's all West Coast guys. West Coast guys love to run, and... You know, my Little League coach always said I should have been a West Coast guy because I love the run, too, so D-Will fits right in. 25-8 and 14 for yourself, but this morning you had a powerful statement. If you're on the floor, you have a chance, your team has a chance to win. It's one thing for you to think and believe that, but to get your teammates to do that also, how? Listen, I'm their leader, I'm their commander, and uh, it's up to me to uh, set the tempo and set the, set the pace every single day, set the example every day. And, uh, you know, it sucks for us right now having two of our you know, our guys out, you know, and that's, uh, you know, JR and, and also Kev. But uh, I got to make sure these guys is locked in and focused because nobody's going to feel sorry for us. And like I said, if I'm in the lineup, we got a chance. We always got a chance every night, and I'm going to get these guys mentally focused every night. LeBron, I appreciate it. Uh, thanks, Allie.